and teachers all across Manitoba are now reacting to the announcement today by the province which could allow all teachers and education workers in Manitoba to get their vaccine south of the border in North Dakota but to say the least the teachers that I spoke to today say that is far from positive. For grade 9 Sisler High School teacher Mike Moroz, the news from the province today, one he cannot agree with. Uh, if, if it wasn't uh, sad, it would be funny. Um, the, it, it's not really a plan at all. There ought to be some details available about a plan that should allow us, he thinks, to travel to another country. Uh, to be vaccinated. Unfortunately for Moreau's, he wouldn't even be able to do that. I, I don't actually have a passport. When we went into the first lockdown last year, my passport expired and I went, well, I guess I don't have to worry about that. I'm not going anywhere anytime soon. Do I need a passport? I can't go if I do. For instance, if Moreau's did have a passport and went to get his vaccine in North Dakota, the question begs, what if he gets a reaction from the shot? Well, what happens if I'm the one that in fact isn't okay. Well, then what happens? How do I get home or am I checked into a North Dakota hospital? I can't afford that. Moreau says there are a ton of unanswered questions here. To add to all of this, students and staff in Manitoba have been hit hard by the third wave, which has prompted schools around the province to move to remote learning. Grades 10 to 12 Glenlawn High School teacher Mike Moyes says this proposal by the province is a barrier at best. The first thing that I thought of when, that, when, I, when I heard it, I, I kind of laughed. I, I was like, is this a joke? Uh, we, we don't typically go to, uh, to other countries in, in the middle of the pandemic and to, to suggest otherwise is just, uh, it, it's, it's quite a, a far out there plan. Moy says this announcement today shows the lack of priority the Pallister government has for teachers. There's lots of teachers that are desperate to get their vaccines in order to keep themselves safe, to keep their family safe, to keep their 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 students safe. You you make it so that teachers would have to travel to another country in order to uh, in order to get their vaccine. That it seems ludicrous to me. We are on the front line, right? You want us to continue to go to work in order to allow other things within the economy, within society, to continue to function. Now, we understand that we're prepared to do that. But that requires a level of support that is not coming. We deserve something better than something you invented on the back of a napkin. In Winnipeg, Alex Carpa City News.